video of install a thorough air conditioner. Firstly, thank you for purchasing our thorough air conditioner. This video will show you how to install our thorough air conditioner. Please don't install it if you are not a qualified installing technician. First step, please prepare these tools for installation. 1. A screwdriver. 2. A inner hexagon spanner. 3. Two spanners. 4. A vacuum pump. 5. A pressure gauge. 6. A bottle of soap water. Second step. Open the package boxes and checking. A solo air conditioner has three cartons, outdoor unit, indoor unit, solo collector. Firstly, open the carton of the outdoor unit. Take out the connecting pipes and the cardboard behind the condenser. Then, take out the main body of the outdoor unit. Secondly, open the solo collector carton. There are an insulation tank and a box of vacuum tube. Two connecting pipes for water tank, brackets for installing the water tank, and so on in it. Thirdly, open the package of indoor unit. There are the indoor unit installation manual, remote controller, wall mounted plate, and some other accessories in the package box of indoor unit. Third step, install a solar collector on the top of outdoor unit. Take the water tank, the bracket, and the connecting pipe out of carton. Then fit the eight pieces stainless steel bolts with washer into the screwing holes of front panel of outdoor unit. Please take care that don't screw too tight. Please keep a 2 to 3 mm space between the front panels and outdoor unit. Then fix the water flowing tank brackets on the front panel of outdoor unit. Tie it with spanner. Loose the two nuts on water tank. Then put the water tank on the water tank bracket. Insert two pieces mounting bolts of water tank into bracket installation hole. Then use the unsnatched nut to fix the water tank and the bracket. Then use the spanner to tighten it. Open the package of vacuum tube. You will see the vacuum tubes put on black decorative ring. Dip some soapy water at the terminal of vacuum tube. It's good for installing the vacuum tube into the water tank. Fixing the vacuum tube into below support and fixing it using four pieces of stainless screw. Tie them with spanner. Putting the plastic retainer into the corresponding hole of support of vacuum tube. Pull the vacuum tube down, adjust it in place. Put the decorative rings on the drainage T, inserting the hole outside of water tank. Remove the two plastic nuts of water tank and four plastic nuts of stopping web on outdoor unit. Fetch the plastic nuts on the two connecting pipes of water tank, then fix them into two webs of water tank and outdoor unit, tighted by using spanners. The first step, install the indoor unit. At the first, take out of the indoor unit. Take down the wall-mounted plate. Use expansion screws to fix the wall-mounted plate on the wall. Take off the insulation pipe behind of indoor unit. Loose copper nut with two spanners. If there is gas go out, miss indoor unit didn't leak. But if no gas go out, means maybe the evaporator or indoor unit has leaked. If with this problem happening, in order to avoid more problems happening in future, please change a new indoor unit. 
take the connecting pipe of indoor and outdoor unit out. Also take out the plastic nuts. Fix the two connecting pipes of indoor unit after making the two pipes straight. Tighten it with spanner, then connecting the draining pipe into water drain pipe of indoor unit. Wrapping the three pipes and the wire with plastic belt. Please not don't wrap the power plug. Then hang the indoor unit on the wall mounted plate. Making all pipeline and wire through the wall hole. The fifth step, connecting out the unit copper pipes and wiring. Connect the one end of two connecting pipes into two stop wire of outdoor unit. Tight it with spanner, connecting the gene tube from indoor unit on the top of plastic tin joint on water tank. Connect the another gene tube into another terminals. Loose the electric cover with the screwdriver. Loose out the clamp. Tighten the power wire and connect the wire of the line sequence to terminal block. Then fix back the electric cover. The sixth step, vacuum mice and open webs. Connecting the two stop webs with pressure gauge. Connecting pipe, fix one middle pipe into vacuum pump. Then turn on the vacuum pump and drain out the air from indoor unit and the water tank. When the pressure gauge shoe below the minus 20 pound, you can turn off the vacuum pump. Loose the hose, open the first stop valve with inner hexagon spanner, screw all nuts tightly. If it can't reach minus 20 pound, maybe the connecting nuts joint not be screwed tightly. Please check each joint with spanner. The seventh step, trial run. Make sure there is no problem of all installation. Please use filner to fill for water from the air vent hole. You can connect the power plug into the pores. Power should to configure fuse and air switch according to the air conditioner specification and need grounded reliably. When in the unit power on them, you will hear voice of beep. Open the back cover of remote controller in the two batteries. Then use the remote controller to turn on. Please note, setting correct mode and temperature. After turning on, it will show setting temperature on the screen. You can set in wind speed temperature, timer on and, and off by pressing buttons. If there's a fault, it will display an error code on the install unit. Then please inform the local service center. Thank you for watching.